Want to bet? You can do it. Sports Interaction. It's Canada's Sportsbook. Football continues. World Series right around the corner. And of course, we've, we've been talking about it and we will continue talking about it. Hockey season has started. Bet pregame, live in play, or on one of the many prop bets made for Canadians by Canadians. Sports Interaction makes it easy to deposit, easy to play, and easy to cash out. High five. High five. Woo! Yeah. High five with the prop on the on the table. Join now <laughs> to see all that sports betting has to offer. Head to sportsinteraction.com slash SDPN. That's sportsinteraction.com slash SDPN. Ontario only. 90 plus. Please play responsibly. High five. Kuznetsov almost takes a guy's head off. And the NHL, and I'm gonna I'm lifting from Steve's Twitter account here, gives him the same penalty as you would get for skipping the All-Star game. Yeah, it's it's uh can we pull up a freeze frame of that, Jesse? Just so mm-hmm. people see. Okay. I think it's uh, it's very important that we have some sort of angle. I'm curious to know what the reasoning was for it only being one game. Because I'll hear the argument that Kuznetsov didn't mean to hit him that high. Like maybe he meant to get him in the shoulder. Or he meant to get him in the chest. Why then, not to make it about the Leafs, did Austin Matthews get two games for cross-checking Rasmus Dahlin in the shoulder, having it ride up the shoulder and hit him in the face. He got two games. You could argue that he should have got more because even though it was an accident, it was him recklessly using his stick in a malicious manner. Towards the head, too. Towards the head. Are you ready? If Gennady Kuznetsov did the same thing and he got one. So we're, we're going to watch. Jesse has it up. I I'm going to play video. the explanation. They always have these little explanation videos with that guy with the fucking monotone voice who's going to come on and tell you everything about why they suspended him. So you asked why it's only one game. Here is the NHL's reasoning. How long is this? A minute 30. That's good. Cool. Monday night in Washington. Capitals forward Evgeny Kuznetsov was penalized for high-sticking Canucks defenseman Kyle Burrows. As the video shows, Kuznetsov takes the puck to the net to try to create a scoring chance, with Burrows defending at the far goal post. The two collide as Kuznetsov cuts across the goal mouth, with Burrows losing his stick and Kuznetsov falling to the ice. As Kuznetsov gets back to his feet, he pulls back his stick and swings it purposefully at Burrows, making contact with his face. This is high stick. <laughs> it is important to note that this is not that this is not a careless use of the stick. I think it froze. Oh, no, it froze. No, it <laughs> I was like, is that it? No. no. I always recognize Kuznetsov's assertion that he did not intend to hit Burrow so this high. Is, this is your explanation. Stick. You know? Rather, this is an intentional stick swing towards an opponent that makes high contact. While we recognize Kuznetsov's assertion that he did not intend to hit Burrow so high, players are accountable for their stick at all times. What causes this play to rise to the level of supplemental discipline is the purposeful nature of the swing and the location where it lands on the opponent. To summarize, this is high sticking. Kuznetsov has been fined once during his 603-game NHL career. The Department of Player Safety has suspended Evgeny Kuznetsov for one game. Oh, yeah, they're just so bad at everything. <laughs> sub <laughs> professional league. <laughs> this is high sticking in case you weren't aware. <laughs> the key point section. Sub professional. Where they just listed two points. <laughs> it, it just, yeah, just high sticking history. <laughs> that was it. I thought I'm we were going to get a that. list. I thought we were going to get a fucking like, row of things that went into the decision. No. Jesse. It was I, just two things. Sub professional. Oh my God. <laughs> the league sucks. <laughs> Boo, you suck. Uh, Amateur league that pays its money. You players. want a screenshot it's, of that? Uh, yeah, that can you just is... screen grab that? And just, I'm just going to throw that out there every time there's a high sticking penalty. <laughs> I'm just going to tweet that high sticking history. <laughs> One and if you don't do it, you're not a fan. All right? I'm oh. begging the National Hockey League to try. <laughs> oh, man. I'm, I'm begging the National Hockey League to try. Like, again, <laughs> they, I'm begging the National Hockey League to follow its own precedence right mm-hmm. so matthews cross checks rasmus Dahlin, rides up hits him in the face yeah yeah kuznetsov does the same thing this is not high sticking and it, like the nhl goes as far to say hey don't give me that bullshit you did this on purpose 
So, listen, the only reason this is a one-game suspension is Kyle Burroughs is fine. That shouldn't matter. <laughs> what if he knocks out an entire row of teeth, which he could have easily done there, and Matthews could have easily done as well with Brass from Stalin? Then what? Oh, well, then the matter of millimeters uh, causes it to be like, what, five, ten? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm begging you to try. I'm begging you to have some pride. I'm begging you to care about this sport a tenth of a tenth as much as the fans of this league do. That's not a one game suspension. You're a f- what a clown show. What a, I, what, what a fucking clown show. I really didn't like the the point in there where they said his intention wasn't to swing the stick at his face gives a fuck that shouldn't matter at all he did it care he fucking he swung a stick right at a dude sub professional yeah that's it's a horrible call it's i don't know what else to call it i'm so disheartened by this league Holy shit. Like, if, if you break a rule and you do something, it's like, ah, I didn't mean to do it. No, that you did it. So when's it going to happen, guys? What? When's it going to happen? What's going to happen? When someone does the exact same thing. Thank you for that. What? Took what? some lint off. Uh, it was very long hair. Yeah, it was, fair enough. <laughs> I have a dog. When is the exact same thing going to happen in this league and the suspension is different? I don't know, a month man. From this now? season, yeah. I don't get Two that. Weeks? Well, I mean, and, and the thing is, honestly, and we've talked about this, and I know you tired of me beating this drum, but head injuries, guys, head injuries, mm-hmm. head injuries. Please, please take the head stuff seriously. Um, Gustav Nyquist. He remember he shanked someone in the face. Can't remember who it was. I think it was someone on the Minnesota Wild. He meant to like spear him or slash him or whatever, but his stick got caught on the glass behind him. And when he brought his stick forward, he ends up literally spearing the guy in the face. I've never seen anything like it. And I thought he was going to get like dozens of game suspensions. He got six. That is a play where the player maliciously wielded their stick. But also there was an accident involved that caused the stick to hit the player in the face. Mm-hmm. Six games. Mm-hmm. I have a response to that. Yeah. High sticking history <laughs> like everybody <laughs> thank you jesse everybody look at the key points. that's key points adam read off the key point so as you can see on your screen it might be hard for you to read this but we have high sticking and that is history okay it's important that you understand the following it's you know it's it's you know what this reminds me of you know when you're in high school and they have to do you have to do like a a, a presentation with uh powerpoint and the person's just like i don't fucking care about this class and they do like three yes and I then they, and then they just and then they just fit the third slide is like nah, i didn't even finish it like no! <laughs> that's what the slide looks like i don't think we're making a big enough deal about how ridiculous this is in, high sticking in conclusion <laughs> <laughs> romeo Juliet, Juliet. <laughs> doomed. <laughs> Montagues and Capulets, curse on their houses. Both your houses do not like each other. <laughs> the National Hockey League has suspended <laughs> Romeo. What was what was Romeo's best friend's name again? Oh, who cares? <laughs> no, Shakespeare. Um, <laughs> Romeo. James Shakespeare. Or something. Earl. Doug Shakespeare. <laughs> Mercutio. Yeah. Remember Mercutio? No. Yeah. Uh, anyway. It's, I vaguely remember the name. Uh, Park. That's when he, when he dies, he says a curse on both your houses. And that's how you get history. Yep. <laughs> so, anyway, ladies and gentlemen. Th- um, to be clear, this <laughs> is cursing. <laughs> the, Na- the National Hockey League <laughs> has sentenced Joe. Mercutio to you're dead. <laughs> They didn't try. No, they, they didn't try. They, they just uh, just I just say fuck it. We don't care. Uh, One just, game. I, I so I I have a little pet theory with suspensions. So half the league is in LTIR, like it's a joke. Um, half the league is incentivized to spend more money in order to save on the salary cap. Makes total sense. Sub professional league. Mm-hmm. Kuznetsov makes over $9 million. And 
a five game suspension Mm -hmm. could potentially really screw the caps. Oh yeah. So the caps do have more forwards on their team now than they need. So they do have spares, Mm -hmm. but like, let's say a leaf got suspended in the final game of the preseason. Let's say Marner temporarily lost his mind. And instead of being a care bear, he just started, you know, wielding, wielding uh, his stick like an ax and he got suspended 10 games. The Leafs would have to play short for two weeks. <laughs> They'd have 17 skaters for like two weeks. They'd be fucked. I don't know what they would do. So I think uh, stars get shorter suspensions. One, because I mean, the league, they're does, stars. They do play favorites. Let's, mm-hmm. let's be honest. But also, teams can't afford for players with substantial cap hits to be suspended. So I have another. Th- I have a thing here, um, and 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 yeah, Steve, I think that's a really good point. The the caps cap situation, just like everybody else's, is a problem. And I want to get to the cap situation in a second because there's actually a big story about that today. Yep. But um, I look at the Kuznetsov thing, and I look at what Nazem Kadri did to Jake DeBrusque in the playoffs. We're never going to let that go. Anyway. I'm not which letting was, this go. Which was what? Which is driving his face into the boards. Yeah, it's it's uh, it's one of the greatest officiating failures in recent memory. And listen, Naz's thing was bad. It was bad. But this is also bad. <laughs> but it's funny that, and we the NHL, remember, they view, they view games uh, missed in the playoffs as two regular season games. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. So Nazem Kadri served, I think it was three games, so that's six games. They suspended him for the rest of the series, and it went which to seven. I've never seen before. So, so he he sits out seven, or he sits out six games for that. No, his suspension in Toronto was the same thing. The one versus Boston. The second one was for the rest of the series. Rest of the series. Yeah. The, what was Wasn't the first this one? The second one. Yeah, I thought the DeBrusque one was the second one. Oh, that's this the, was the second that's one. The, oh, okay, the okay, nineteen okay. one. Yeah. Okay, okay. The first yeah. one was he hit. Uh, oh, he hit someone else. I yeah. Don't yeah I, also, I, I always get them. Confused. I also want to throw this out there. I don't Tommy know. Wingles, so I Tommy, Tommy Wingles. Anybody else? Tommy Wingles. Yeah. Tommy Wingles. Some fucking g- <laughs> Jeff guy. Yeah. Jake the Kaiser. Jake the Kaiser. <laughs> the second. Um, I'm looking at I'm looking at what Kyle Clifford did in the playoffs last year in Game One, which is a tenth of what that is. No. And he served what, what equates to two games. You're forgetting history and high sticking. Like, You're right. Look at history and high sticking. We must go back and examine. Can you bring it back on the board? We need to examine this one more time because the, maybe the title of this episode has to be history, history. high sticking. <laughs> <laughs> Please, Jesse, bring this back up. Because oh, it's, it's important it's that not, we re-examine. It's sub-adult. <laughs> He's vaguely it, he's act doing like it. a grown up. I'm begging. There it is. Hands and knees. I'm begging. So here it is, guys. <sighs> there you go. Yeah. Even though Kyle Clifford served double the amount of time that Kuznetsov will serve for a minor hit to the head. Was it a minor? It wasn't even a hit to the head. It was a hit from behind. It was from behind. It was bad. It was bad. And he got five. He got five, five in that and game. So, five so that's game. so that's yeah. technically two games. So and, that's four games. And he was suspended. Uh, because After. it was a really bad hit. Oh, wait, sorry. I meant to say he was suspended because the Leafs killed the penalty and won the game. Leafs, Leafs get scored on and lose that game. Guaranteed he doesn't get suspended. And again, I, I, I want to remind adult. you, I want to bring you back to the PowerPoint presentation, which is high sticking and history. History. Have important. you considered? Important that you frame this in your mind. Never forget it. Okay, let's move on. <laughs> 